How you guys? This is Black and Blue, and I don't know about you, but I'm ready to get into today's cash stuffing video. <laughs> Let's go. This is Black and Blue. Go ahead. What's the crime? An attempt to watch and not subscribe? Yep, that's a crime. Friends don't let friends watch and not subscribe. So, <laughs> come on, let's get into the video. Okay, that was actually really good. I was about to redo it because I... Anyways, what's up, you guys? So, we're doing a YouTube cash stuffing video today, and I am so excited. It's been a long time coming, actually. I got paid last month in June on the 21st, and it's been up until right now that we're actually going to stuff this. And there's a couple different places that I want to stuff it, so I'm super excited. We're going to get into that. I will count and let you guys know just how much we're stuffing from our YouTube paycheck. I can't forget my fingertip moistener <laughs> because it just makes counting money so much easier. And I do have these in my shop if you're interested or you're like, I need sort quick. That's what it is. It's sort quick and I just bling the top of them. But let's go ahead and count and see how much we're stuffing today. I'll put this right here. Mm, no. I'll put it right here. Mm, no. Look, I'm like, where do I put it? Okay, so we have 20, 40, 60, 81, 20, 40, 60, 82, 20, 40, 60, 83, 20, 40, 60, 84, 20, 40, 60, 80, 500, 20, 40, 60, 86, 20, 40, 60, 80, 90, 700. These bills are terrible feeling. 700, 10, 20, 30, 40, 5, 55, 65, 75, 85, 95, 800. 5, 10, 15, 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89, 90, 91, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96, 97, 98, 99, 900. <laughs> Yay. Okay. So let's go ahead and get stuffing. I usually don't put this over here, but I'm just going to see how it is on my left side, which is I'm right handed, but you know, you know. <laughs> okay. So. For starters, I don't think I ever talked about it on my channel, but my identity, my identity, my identity, uh, my identity wasn't stolen, I don't think, but my credit card information was. So I did have to go ahead and cancel my credit card with my bank and then get a new one shipped out to me. I am still dealing with making sure I've got my automatic payments switched over to the new card, but I just found out that there is one that I missed and that is going to be my gym membership. So I need to come back over here and go ahead and add into my gym because put this right here as my bookmark because they let me know that I am <laughs> one month behind. So I was like, no. So I'm never late on payments. That's just not a thing. But I'm gonna go ahead and take out 40 and put it towards this. And I'm gonna go and pay it in person. They said that I can't switch my card over over the phone so I'm like okay well then thanks for giving me the information I guess I'll pop in and pay it since I couldn't do it on the phone and I was too busy today to go but I'll be going tomorrow well for you guys it's today <laughs> so this is my this is my bills binder if you guys saw the the categories mortgage HOA these are my cloud envelopes and this is my sweater weather binder that I do have in my shop it's a zippered a6 binder I have a6 and a5 and you can see my cute logo I did design this binder I drew it out and told them exactly what I wanted and they did it for me and they executed so beautifully ah oh, I love it now I'm going to show you guys, before we stuff anything else, I have an unboxing. It's with She Said Yes, and I've been waiting for what's in here. Do not fast forward, because this is cool, okay? I just showed you guys my pretty binder. You guys have seen this, but it has a little something to do with what's in here, and I'm super excited. So, She Said Yes is a beautiful, beautiful company where you're able to buy beautiful, gorgeous jewelry, silver or gold, and... It could be for any any occasion. They've got wedding rings, anniversary, I'm so excited, engagement, all of the above. 
best wishes to you. Customize what you love. And then you are able to write a note on here if you are gifting this to somebody. Super pretty. Oh, thank you. We appreciate your business. They give you a 15% off coupon code. Okay. Yay. How to care for your jewelry. Now what I love about this company, they have Moise Night Jewelry. That is, a lot of people have not heard of Moise Night, and I don't know how, but they've got Moise Night Gold Jewelry, General Jewelry Care Tips, and this is how you're going to be able to take care of it if you're not sure how to. Now, Moise Night Jewelry, I love to rave about it. I've raved about Moise Night for, I want to say, over five years at this point, but five, six, seven, about seven years maybe? Something like that. But moissanite is the second strongest stone next to diamonds. I tell you guys every time it's gorgeous. It's not just gorgeous. It's not just beautiful, but it's going to last because when you have stones that are glass or cubic zirconia or anything like that, over time bumping and all of that, your jewelry will start to dull out. And once it's scratched up, it gets dull. But moissanite is cool because if you think of a diamond, diamond is the hardest stone. Anything that scratches a diamond is not going to actually scratch it unless it's a diamond. A diamond is the only thing that can scratch a diamond. A moissanite is second in line for hardness in stone. And moissanite, the only thing that can scratch a moissanite is another moissanite or a diamond. You know, so if you're bumping up against things, it's going to shine bright for way, way, way longer than other stones. So I just love moissanite so much and they tell you here how to take care of it and they have moissanite stones in their shop. So super beautiful. If you're wanting an engagement ring and you're not trying to break the bank, but you like the way diamonds look, moissanite and diamond, you literally barely can even tell the difference. I can't, honestly, at all. I can't tell the difference between a diamond and a moissanite. The clarity is beautiful and absolutely perfect and just... It's amazing. Anyways, I go, I like going on a soapbox about that just because it's so cool and a lot of people don't know about it. But she said yes, we'll give you a bag in your package if you are gifting the jewelry that you purchase. They have a bag that you can use and put your box inside of it as well as a really pretty pink ribbon. Gorgeous. But I'm gifting this to myself. <laughs> this is the box. They have, this is their newer box. I actually like this one more. The other one was beautiful. It had a little button here where you could pop it we won't push it and then it was slowly open i actually like this more than that even though that was really cool and innovative i am really loving their new their new box even more all right let's show you guys what's in here i think it's in a baggie it is oh my gosh it's so pretty ah oh, i was so excited i was so excited don't rip off this little tag on here until you know it fits and everything like that but this, what's inside here, I am so excited because <laughs> when I saw this, I freaked out. I'm always looking at their website and scouring all of their rings and jewelry. And I saw this and I was like, no way. Okay, let me show you guys up close if I can. Okay. If you can see this, it's literally quilted. Let me turn my hand around. Let me take this off, actually, because this is making it harder for me to show you guys. I'm just going to take this off because I know I'm not returning it. Oh, my gosh. It's so pretty. <gasps> what figure do I want to put it on? Oh, my gosh. I have options. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Let me show you with it on my finger. So, this literally has quilted with crystals in the... So, basically, let me show you. It looks like this quilted, and then it's got stones in the crosshairs. <laughs> and it's so pretty. Oh my gosh, it literally matches my binders. I was so excited when they said I could choose this ring. I was so happy. And you guys, I have a discount code for this company. It's in my description box. It's always in my description box, but go check them out because it's so nice. Oh my gosh, I don't know what finger I want to wear this on. I don't want to put it on a finger that I'm... <laughs> oh my gosh I always love having a thumb ring on oh my gosh if it's perfect look at that oh my gosh it's beautiful <sighs> this right here mm. 
I honestly think this is my favorite ring so far from She Said Yes. And I've got a lot of beautiful rings from them. But I think this one's going to be my favorite of all time. <laughs> it's so pretty. Look at that. It literally matches my binder. I love this look so much. Okay, let me carry on because I can literally get stuck talking about this <laughs> till the end of time. So let's carry on with our cash stuffing. I am going to now go to my long-term binder. This is my binder that I use for my long-term savings. That means that, and this is what it looks like. This one is also in my shop. I also designed this one as well. We have a drip here and the name of my shop is Drift by E. So that's why I have a dripping E and then I have the drips right here. It's so beautiful. Now this binder, I want to go ahead and add into, I did not update my trackers yet. So we're going to put the money behind the tracker. Yes. So we have $25. I still need to add and we are going to go ahead and add 50, 20, 40, 50. Fifty in emergency. I want to add forty in my savings, and I really can't thank you guys enough because this paycheck that I have is literally because those of you that watch my videos are helping me with your views, your likes, your comments, everything. I appreciate you guys so much. This video literally wouldn't be possible without you guys. We're gonna add forty in for my daughter's college so excited so I'm going to back to school is good right now medical I'm so excited about medical because of my daughter's braces not being as expensive as I thought they were gonna be so excited about that holidays oh I'm so excited the holidays are coming up my fiance my dog is fully funded and then vacation I do want to add to vacation because at some point we need to go somewhere and I think I know where I want to go I'm gonna make my fiance pay for most of it but I will help out a little bit <laughs> Oh my gosh. I don't know if you guys just heard that. That was my daughter in my ear. So yes, we're going to add that. I literally know where, where I want to go for vacation. Okay. Maybe I'll talk about that in another video, but I might come back to this binder. But before I do, I actually want to go and jump into one of my savings challenges that I'm really excited to get more of done. That's gonna be this one, my 100 envelope challenge. And there we go. And this one, we are on envelope number 47. With this challenge, normally you would stuff the amount that's on the front, the number. So this challenge, I don't believe I'm gonna be restocking once it sells out, which is crazy. But I've had so much fun with this challenge. It's been a blast to do. It's been a blast to sell and uh, make for others. And I think this might be one of the ones that go away once they're sold out, you know? Cause I mean, well, I've always got ideas and moving on to more things. So if you got one of these challenges, you're gonna be an OG at some point because it's not gonna be available forever. But I am actually multiplying the numbers on these envelopes. So instead of putting 47, I'm going to put four times seven and stuff that amount. Let me grab my calculator because I don't like to be wrong. I'm sure that's 28 or something like that, but let me grab my calculator. Four times seven. Yep. 28. I knew it. <laughs> this is my bookmark. These are also in my shop and I'm just going to put this on the side and it's keeping track of where I am in my challenge. So we're going to be doing $28, 25, 26, 27, and 28. All right, next up is 46 and six times four is 24. I might round up. I wasn't gonna round up for this challenge, but I do wanna get this closer to being done. So I am gonna round up, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me, it's always good to have more than less, but let's go ahead and stuff that. Five, 10, 15, 20, four times five is 20. And then four times four is four, eight, 12, 16, 10, 15, 16. And then four times three is 12, four, eight, 12. Yeah, I'm like, wait, is that right? 
10, 11, 12. And then four times two is eight. I just love when stuffing challenges so much. And then seeing money in my home is nice, but I love the idea of it earning me more money by sitting in my high yield savings account. And a lot of people always ask me, which one do I bank with for my high yield? And that's going to be Capital One. They've done me pretty good. I don't know much about other banks when it comes to high yield, but so far I signed up for Capital One and I'm loving it. Four times one is four. One, two, three, four. Now four times zero is zero for 40 and I am not stuffing zero in any of these. So if the number ends in zero, the equation, then I stuff the exact number that's on here, which is 40. So we're gonna be putting 40 in here. I love how deep they go. I asked them when I had these created, I said, make them go as deep as they can. I don't want any perforations and I don't want them to shorten it just because there's no holes punched in it. So exactly how I wanted it is how they made it. So 9, 18, 27. Ooh, what's on there? 27 for three times nine. 27, 25, 26, 20, 25, 26, 27. Perfect. Eight times three is 24. We're gonna do 25. Seven times three is 21. We'll do 25. And yes, that is jumping higher, but it's okay. It makes it even more fun to count in the end. We want a higher number. <laughs> 37, 6, 12, 18. 3 times 6 is 18. We'll do 20. 20. I'm rough on these envelopes. I'm like, yank. <laughs> uh, 15, 5 times 15. And then 3 times 4, 4, 8, 12 again. We'll do 15. Yay, we're out of the pink. We finished all of the pink envelopes. Now we're into the purple. Three times three is three, six, nine. We'll do 10. Three times three is nine. I love when you guys tell me how you guys are doing your 100 envelope challenge because it's fun doing it different ways and you guys are just giving me more ideas for the next time I do it. Three times two is six. We'll do 10. Three times one is three, so we'll do five. I love these envelopes, they're just so pretty. 30, 25, 30 because three times zero is zero. And we're gonna stuff the actual face value of this envelope, which is $30. Nine times two is 18, so we'll do 20. Eight times two is 16, so we will do 20 again. Fourteen, so we'll do 15, five, 10, 15. Six times two is 12, so we'll do 15. Five times two is 10, five, 10. You would think I was left-handed the way I'm grabbing this money over here. <laughs> Four times two is eight. 
so we'll do 10. See how the numbers are going smaller and smaller? It's like, when I started with the high number the, um, in the beginning, it, I just knew the ending was gonna feel a lot nicer. <laughs> Three times two is six, so we'll do 10. Once I start this challenge, if I have the money sitting next to me, I wanna just stuff it as much as I can. <laughs> two times two is four, so we'll put five. It is hard stuffing the exact amount though, if you don't check what denominations you need ahead of time, because you just don't know. Two times one is two, so we'll do five. We've got a zero, so we're gonna put the face value, which is 20. nine oops i would want to put 10 but i don't have 10 18 oh my gosh we're so close you guys we're so close how many one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve oh my gosh i could technically stuff probably 12 more envelopes and we have 19 left oh my goodness yeah i'm doing it nine times one is nine but i'm gonna do 20. this is someone who wants to get it done like now <laughs> get this money in the bank yes i do it should be eight but we're doing 20. this should be seven but we're doing 20. i should put that on a hoodie this should be but we're doing 20. <laughs> Six, but we're doing 20. Five, we have a five. This should be four, but we're doing 20. Three, but we're doing 20. I might have to do the math for you guys on this one, unless one of you guys already did. If you multiply all the numbers, how much would you be saving in the end? Because I was doing exact numbers so we could find out together, but now that I'm putting more in than is needed, I'm not gonna know what that number is unless I do the math on a calculator. <laughs> unless I add them all up. 11, so this should be one, literally a, a dollar, So we're doing 20. This should be $10 because we have to stuff the face value. But we're doing 20. And then we're down to single digits. And that means we're literally stuffing what's on the front. But we're doing 20 for nine. And 20 for eight. Yay. All right, we got seven envelopes left and I'm pretty positive I'm gonna go ahead and finish this off in my next savings challenge video, which is gonna be this Friday. So make sure you guys check out that video. I am definitely going to go ahead and try to finish this. We're on number seven. Maybe I'll close it out with exact <laughs> denominations. Okay, that was awesome. I am so happy I did that. Yeah, I'm happy. That was a good idea. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. I appreciate you guys for being here. Thank you for watching and helping me even be able to make this video because like I said before, if you guys didn't watch my videos, I wouldn't get a paycheck from YouTube. But since you guys do and you guys subscribe, you comment, you like, I'm able to do videos like this and save like this. So thank you so much. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. She said yes for this beautiful ring. I am in love. I'm just staring at it, but thank you so much. I will catch you guys in the next video. I'm out of here. Bye.